Dexter's Laboratory, SWAT Cats, The Pop of Girls, and Johnny Bravo. Just some of the cartoons we would spend our afternoons and evenings watching after school. By the way, uh, how many of you actually set your password that's omelette to fromage from that uh, particular Dexter's episode? Well, in recent times, it seems that nostalgia has made a comeback in a big way. Movies and series are being remade. One of the most prominent examples being Cobra Kai, based on the 80s Karate Kid series. Basically, it's the time machine which we all want to be part of. But the film world is not the only place where memories from the 80s and 90s are being relived. The ad world is part of it too. Which is why a host of old ads are being shown in a new avatar and long forgotten cartoon characters are making a big comeback. Take for example the case of Mortin, the pest control brand which has relaunched its nemesis Louis in a new avatar as Louis the Mosquito after a gap of about 5 years. The purple colored green eye mosquito is used for spreading awareness, keeping in line with Mortin's goal of eradicating malaria in India by 2030. The mosquito has been around in ads since 2004 and in the latest one, well, spoiler alert, he dies again, but that's the point of Mortin, right? There's nothing more annoying than the buzzing of a mosquito in your ears at 2 a.m. in the morning when you have office tomorrow, which is why uh, sprays like Mortin really come in handy. Now another quirky character who has made a comeback in recent times is Fido Dido, 7-Up's mascot, a thin, tall, curly-haired man who was a popular character for kids back in the 90s uh, which they used to draw in their art books. In his new avatar, he helps a lady cross the road in his own unique way. Now back in the day, 7-Up had entered the Indian market in 1990 and two years later we saw Fido Dido on our TV screens and bottles. But the one ad which went really viral on social media was the reimagining of the Cadbury cricket ad from the 90s. Now in the old ad, a girl dances onto the stadium's pitch to celebrate her boyfriend's century. Shimona Rashi was the girl who was instantly nicknamed as the Cadbury girl. For over two decades later, the ad was recreated by them. This time, it's a female cricketer for whom her boyfriend rushes onto the stadium when she hits a century scoring shot, while the jingle Kuch Khas To Hai plays in the background. This entire incident is said to have been inspired from an actual incident when a young fan planted a kiss on cricketer Abbas Ali Beg's cheek way back in the 60s. Of course, as one brand in India whose mascot we know all too well, which is Amul's utterly butterly girl, who has been setting trends long before the word trend became a fixture on social media. Now, there are a whole lot of other ads which are using the same theme. Nostalgia has become part of these different universes, as I mentioned before, including movies and web series. And among the ones slated for a release is another movie with Shakti Man, the Indian superhero. Personally, of course, I feel that instead of battling evil scientists and stone men, he should wage a war against the entire pouting culture, which seems to have taken over the impressionable youth of today. But uh, that's what I think. What are your thoughts?